Hello and welcome to Old Man Stories. Today we are going to talk about Namazu, known as the Earthshaker. According to Japanese myth the cause of earthquakes is the giant catfish Namazu or Namazui, living buried in the underground. Namazu is one of the yokai, in a very broad sense translatable as monster, creatures of Japanese mythology and folklore that were associated or caused misfortune or disasters. By moving his tail he can shake the entire earth and unfortunately he loves to cause a lot of trouble. Namazu can be controlled only by the god Kashima, which with help of a powerful capstan pushes the fish against the underground and in such doing immobilized him. However the god sometimes got tired, or is distracted from his duty and Namazu can move a bit and cause an earthquake. Already in the Tokugawa period 1603 the giant catfish was as a river deity associated to natural disasters, not surprisingly caused by water, like floods or heavy rainfall. In these early traditions however Namazu acts often as a premonition of danger, warning people from an imminent catastrophe, or by swallowing dangerous water dragons prevents even disasters. Earthquakes, as apparently trembles of earth, or explained by movements of deities or creatures supporting the Japanese main islands, these creatures included gods, giants and ox, dragons or snakes and a fish. The dragon was a very old and powerful symbol imported from China, and was in old times the main culprit of earthquakes. However during the 18th century, the giant Namazu gradually replaced the giant dragon in the popular imagination. This change from dragon to Namazu was minor, because dragons were also associated to water and rivers and so were closely related to the catfish in the popular imagination. During the 19th century and after the earthquake of Edo modern Tokyo in October 1855 the wrongdoings of Namazu became more a punishment of human greed. It was believed that the catfish by causing havoc forced people to redistribute equally their wealth, and this role Namazu became Yuneyoshi Daimajin, the god of world rectification. The classic images of Namazu, more than 300 or Tadena, were mainly a response of the Edo earthquake by trying to depict also positive aspects. Of the earthquake the artists hoped to rise the morals of the survivors. Namazu was used also in satire, he is represented as a good-for-nothing, coward acting only when the gods are gone, a reference to the aristocracy and incompetent civil servants. There are various versions of the myth with slight modifications, in some narratives the god doesn't use a rock but a sword to nail the Namazu onto the ground. According to another version, it is the god Kadori controlling the catfish, with the help of a giant and magical pumpkin. Also the main villain can be represented by a giant eel Jinshin Yuo or a giant earthquake beetle Jinshin Mushi. That's all for today. We will meet again with another story. Please press the like button and don't forget to subscribe.